二零零五年，本港几个同性恋团体发起小规模公开游行，成功吸引传媒报道。二零零八年，同性恋团体举行首届香港同志游行，主题系骄傲爱上街。有同性恋团体声称，呢次游行令香港继台湾之后，成为第二个最大嘅华人同志游行城市。二零零九年初，政府建议修订家庭暴力条例，包括将同性同居者纳入保障范围，引起唔少立法会议员同市民激烈反对。而同性恋团体亦极力争取双方喺立法会门口请愿。期间，由于不满有目者公开表示，担心家庭暴力条例修订案通过，最终可能导致同性婚姻合法化。有同性恋团体就发动几百名网民到呢间教会门口示威游行。同年十二月，呢项修订获得通过，条例改名为《家庭及同居关系暴力条例》。相比喺美加，香港同性恋运动相对比较温和，但一直悄然发展。不过，会唔会有一日香港都会面临好似北美咁样嘅情况呢？早前，美国加州基督徒律师 Brad Dacus 嚟到香港，同教会以及关注同性恋运动影响嘅人士对话。Brad 曾经担任美国国会参议员嘅法律助理，一九九七年创办 Pacific Justice Institute 太平洋法律协会，联合一班基督徒律师喺法律上维护家长权益、宗教自由等等。佢亲身打过唔少同同性恋运动相关嘅官司。Under one case that we we saw was dealing with a, a two professionals who had a fertility clinic. These two Christian professionals decided they only wanted to provide services because of their religious beliefs、uh, to people who are married. A lesbian couple came in.、Uh, they denied them coverage and said, "There's other places you can go." They filed a lawsuit, and they won that lawsuit with the courts declaring that、uh, that businesses,、uh, despite their religious beliefs, I cannot deny such services、uh, to individuals, even though it violates their, their beliefs and their own conscience.、Uh, this is a serious、uh, assault on people of faith. 类似嘅案例喺香港都发生过。二零零五年，有同性恋团体想喺一间书店门口嘅书架摆放宣传同性恋嘅免费小册子，店主因为自己嘅基督教信仰而拒绝。之后，十几名同性恋团体成员闯入书店抗议，直到店主报警先至离开。如果话成年人有自行判断、决定嘅能力，令 Brett 最担忧嘅系美国同性恋运动正向青少年灌输佢哋嘅价值观。With regards to public schools,、uh, this is one of the most serious areas of social、uh, invasion or indoctrination that we've seen take place. As a result of the, their movement,、uh, children in classrooms all the way down to kindergarten、uh, often have presentations that uh, promote uh, homosexuality, cross-dressing, transsexuality.、Uh, a classic example、uh, is, is what happened、uh, not too long ago in California. Brett 讲紧嘅系加州嘅 SB 四十八法案。呢項法案要求公立學校喺社會科學同歷史課堂加入有男女同性戀、雙性戀同埋變性背景嘅歷史人物。呢、这個法案被廣泛質疑，認為課堂應當着眼喺歷史人物對社會嘅影響同貢獻，而唔係睇佢哋屬於邊個群體。但儘管係咁，呢項法案仍然喺二零一一年十二月被加州州長通過。Uh, this is a blatant attempt. Uh, to provide students with these role models that are exactly that role models、uh, for them to to follow and to be influenced by,、uh, and this is very important when we when we realize that that children are very impressionable,、uh, their their self identity and just as important their specifically their gender identity、uh, is in a developmental process, and that's why it's it's so dangerous.
喺同性婚姻仲未合法化嘅时候，同性恋文化已经可以喺法律嘅遮掩之下，向美国嘅新一代灌输。但调翻转嚟讲，如果同性恋者唔能够结婚，又系咪剥夺咗佢哋公民权利咧 ？As a civil rights attorney, I take great offence to those in the LGBT movement who claim that their civil rights are violated because they're not recognizing they don't have homosexual marriages recognized by the government. This is not a, a, a lifestyle and behavior that is advantageous、uh, for society, much less to the individuals who choose to engage in it. Now, mind you, they have that freedom. Society and, and developed countries have recognized the freedom of individuals to make those choices. But to force and pressure government to affirmatively、uh, exalt, to acclaim, to recognize、uh, this, this, this lifestyle. In view of the, the, the serious negatives to the general welfare of society that it, that it poses,、uh, is ludicrous. Brett 认为美国同性恋运动唔单止冇失去公民权利，反而仲利用紧社会同法律嘅容忍，变相推人霸权。Uh, and that they use the, the, that code language tolerance very loosely, but they also use it very hypocritically, because the LGBT movement is also very committed to silencing people. Who do not agree with their opinions. So, in other words, they want tolerance one way, but not but not both ways. And one thing we've learned is in the area of civil rights and constitutional law is that is that one-way tolerance is not tolerance at all. It's tyranny, and it's a, a direct abridgment to civil liberties and human rights. Brett 对今日美国同性恋运动所取得嘅成功痛心疾首。今次佢嚟到香港分享，就系、是、好希望香港基督徒同家长及早关注呢个问题。The LGBT movement,、uh, we have learned, is actively involved here in Hong Kong, without question.、Um, they will be pushing、uh, for legislation,、uh, inevitably,、uh, to mandate homosexual marriages、uh, be recognized. The LGBT movement, actually, and when we look at the United States of America and other states, it's very predictable. Very predictable.、Uh, at first, they'll they will seek、uh, legislation to prevent harassment uh, or uh, to prevent uh, uh, you know actions, overt actions、uh, against them. Second is mandatory tolerance. Third. Is, accept, is acceptance. Fourth is censorship of people who don't agree with them, and fifth is criminalization, prosecution, and, and firing of individuals who don't accept it and don't agree with it. That is their their game plan. They've played it out long and, and, and hard. Brett 提醒香港人，美国同性恋运动嘅成功，其中一个原因系佢哋一步一步慢慢争取。香港唔可以再唔連結起嚟守住陣線。Brad 甚至指出，美國眾多教會同信徒冇作出行動，其實都助長咗同性戀運動嘅成功。So unfortunately, they've been successful because of what hasn't been done. That is what the churches and Christians and 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 people of faith in the United States have not done. They've often been quiet. They've tried to ignore what's taking place in the public schools. They don't speak up when they see revolting things on television, and they don't address the fundamental problems、uh, truly relating to the development of homosexuality in their own churches, and that is the absence of a father, a loving, affirming, bonding father,、uh, with their sons and daughters. 身为父亲嘅 Brett 相信。唔少人選擇同性戀嘅生活方式，係因為喺成長階段探求自我性別角色嘅時候，缺少父親嘅陪伴、榜樣或者肯定。You know, the studies show that,、uh, without, that the number one correlative, correlation, correlative factor with homosexuality is the absence of a father, a caring, loving father is willing to bond and affirm either the, the, the masculinity of their son. An acceptance of their son, or the femininity of their daughter, an acceptance of their daughter. Fathers need to be there and engage and play a role. And it's not easy, particularly when you have a a high work environment that exists in, in many cultures of the United States, particularly here in Asia. But nonetheless, affirming, loving, 
uh, bonding with their, with their boys and girls by the Father is, is critical uh, if, we're, if we're going to help meet that fundamental needs that the that children end up uh, needing later on. 身处香港 ，Brad 默默为香港祈祷，希望喺形势仲未太迟之前，教会同信徒可以有所行动。佢认为教会唔应该回避呢个话题，要主动教导圣经嘅立场。佢更加鼓励信徒要喺自己嘅领域发挥专长，阻止同性恋文化嘅传播，建立符合圣经嘅价值观。Good laws are not passed unless there are good people passing them. And so we at the Pacific Justice Institute encourage people of faith uh, to have the boldness to prayerfully consider possibly going into the area of law, going to law school, and becoming perhaps a, a legislator uh, or someone who's involved in setting policies. Uh, because those positions and that influence will have a tremendous effect and impact on religious freedom and our ability as Christians to not only live our faith, but share our faith. With others around us. 不过，上帝赐下真理俾我哋，并唔系要我哋去批判人。喺坚持啱同错嘅同时，我哋更加要学习耶稣嘅怜悯，去爱嗰啲未明白真理、接受真理嘅人。Truth is powerful, but truth is only as powerful as the love that is grafted to it to allow it to stick. And so. When we, when we communicate our message of our morals and our beliefs and our values, our love for individuals, all individuals, and compassion for what they're going through, whatever it may be, must be just as evident as the truth that we're conveying. That is a key component for our message to be heard and for lives to be changed and for societies and countries to be saved.